What's up, everybody? It's Aiden Sports Show, and welcome back to another AFL Evolution to Melbourne Demons. Coach Mo, round 21. We've got the Collingwood Magpies here today. So, before we get started, please like and subscribe to the Aiden Sports Show YouTube channel. Sorry for the noise at the background. Didn't have my thing, my microphone plugged in. Please subscribe to the Aiden Sports Show YouTube channel. Turn notifications on. The goal is 60 subscribers. We're 54 at the moment. Things can change, of course, from the time of this upload. But let me know in the comments below, do you think we will beat the almighty Collingwood Magpies? Um, first versus second at the moment. Uh, they've won a lot of their games in a row, so he, he, yeah, it's very interesting to see and um, Yeah, that's the gonna be the question. Can we be Collingwood and also is this the finals matchup? Are we gonna see the grand final matchup right here in this very episode because both of the teams are guaranteed to make the finals. Um, obviously, with two matches being played, a lot of the teams confirmed will make the finals. I'll show you the ladder at the end of the video, but let's see. And here we go. Here come Melbourne and Collingwood. Uh, I haven't played in a while. And Collingwood have the full-on uh, full fireworks and everything. Bro. What is this, man? We got uh, Jeremy Howe coming back to Melbourne. To, uh, to face Melbourne. Very interesting there. I'm not sure if he'll be playing or not, but that's his team. And here come the captains. I predict Melbourne are going to win this coin toss. Come on, boys. Make us proud. Pack Stadium at the MCG. Oh, man. I miss these days. Anyway, let's see. Prusy's the captain. I don't know why that is. I feel like that's still a glitch. Collingwood win it. We're going to skip this now. We're going to lose every single rock battle, but it's going to be worth it, boys. Let's see if we can get this win. And, yep, just like I predicted. Big bump, and here come Collingwood. Oh, that... How's that not 15? Oh, and the routine continues. Oh, it's hit the post. Very lucky. I guess that counts as the routine continuing. Melvin conceding early, but um, not conceding a goal. All right, what can we do here? Gonna try and kick it to a one-on-one. -on -one. Brayshaw with the punch. Oh, tackle by tackle for Hibbin, no prior. Oh, well, he's not taking the ruck anymore. Okay. Oliver with the tackle, and Viney now has the speed. He's gonna kick it to a one-on-one -on -one contest. Neil Bullen can't get the mark. Oh, big bump. Mitch Brown. No mark. How could a mark it? Very surprising there. Big bump by McDonald Petrarca. Hannon. Oh, uh, Maelstrom, sorry. I'm kicking it to Petrarca. I probably should have went a little bit further in because there was a guy right there. I tried to change my mind last second. It didn't let me. Come on, big punch and we get it. And it's bumped. Tackle by, oh, bump by Petrarca. Brown. Petrarca. He's running into an open goal. I can't. Oh my God. I've done it again. <laughs> All right, it's tied 1-1. One, one. Oh, no. What, why did I do... Oh, I'm so bad at this game. How is this on All-Australian? And I'm making a meme out of this game, honestly. Uh, and here they come with their ta uh, hand-passing pressure. And a big bump by the boys. Viney gets tackled with a no prior opportunity. Come on, we need to win this. And we do. Prusy does well. Oh. Langdon. Come on, we need the bounce. We need the bounce. Spargo. All right. I, I tried to kick it into the goal square. Didn't really work out that way. But we got it back into our forward line. Big hit to nobody, really. And it's cleared away. No mark and for Crow for Collingwood. It's very open space for Collingwood. Pendlebury, the captain. Hand passes Jones. Can't get the tackle. Oh, they're playing very well with their short kicks here. That's definitely Collingwood-esque at the moment. Pendlebury, he's tackled. What happened? Where did he pass that to? Terrible mistake. Come on. Big hand pass. Lever. McDonald's. Good mark by McDonald's. And we're about to settle for a shot. The, top, the score is 1-1. One, one. He just ran through the mark, ref. Come on, ref. Disgusting. Just run right through, bro. It's free entry. And it looks like this should be a goal. And it is a goal. Melbourne get on the go on the goal scoring first with Tom McDonald. He's celebrating. He loves it, mate. And so do I. Well done, Tom McDonald. And here we go. 
with a big hit, tackle. Collingwood looks like they're going to get this clearance too. Wide open he is, and he plays on. And this is going to be another goal for Collingwood. They tie it straight away. Again, no defense from Melbourne whatsoever. That's appalling, man. You have your settings on defensive and everything. Nothing works. You just need to win the clearance. And Prusi does win the clearance. But it goes right to Collingwood. Cleared away into the square. Tackles again. Brayshaw. Big mark by Brown. No one marks it. Malstrom, tackle. And another tackle. We got Brown again. Just can't get it to Malstrom. Intercepted. Tackled. And they've won the, the... They've got the midfielders, man. They're running the midfield at the moment. Oh, that's going to be an easy mark for them. No mark. May. He's going to clear it away, May. And that's a very good kick. And Brayshaw. He's going to play on Brayshaw. This is exciting footy. There we go. All right. And he takes it. Come on, big mark. No mark. Oh, and he's bumped out of it. And I can't bump the life out. I can't bump anybody to save my life. Tackle. No tackle. Nathan Jones gets bumped. No mark, though. First quarter ends and the score is tied 7-7. Seven to seven. A very open-ended contest from both sides here. Um, and honestly, very low scoring for how open both teams are. Very interesting how that's being played. But let's see what we can do. Pendlebury tackles early. And Collingwood. It's a one-on-one -on -one situation here. Big bump by May. Out on the full. That's a tackle. That's a good tackle. And they're going to have to take this shot. It looks like they can score from here. He might have to play on. If he's taking a drop punt, I'll be very surprised. He's got the behinds. All right, that's fair. That's fair. All righty. Short kick here. All right, play on. Kick it into that sort of area. Punched. Spargo with the tackle. No prior. A lot of ball ups in this game so far. Another big hit. Prusi can't get the tackle. Every oh well done. Prusi ends up re Brayshaw. Oh, here we go. Open. It's open fifty at the moment. And we're gonna take that mark. Very very convincing stuff from Melbourne. And it looks like that's a good goal. I hope. I hope. That's the goal. Melbourne are taking the lead. Five point lead. Very good stuff from Melbourne. Counter-attacking, isn't it? We, we we get on the defense, and then we go and clear into the offense, but we got the clearance this time. No mark from anybody, Spargo. Can Spargo get something on the end? No, no prior for Spargo. McDonald here to take the ball up, and he wins it. Oh, Pendlebury. Pendlebury, this is exactly like he is in real life, isn't he? Always has the space. Lever to take the mark, and that's how Lever is in real life. Going to try and kick it to the ruck contest. Poor kick in the end. And Mason Cox ends up getting it. Oh, he's he's dropped the mark. And Leaf is going to have to pull out something incredible here. No one gets the mark. Cleared away. Hannon. And Tom McDonald. Very far out. Anybody going to make a lead? There's someone right there. Well done, boys. And Bailey Fritch is going to get a shot on goal. All we need is a perfect executed kick. I'm not sure if that's going to do it. That seems pretty good to me, lads. Beautiful goal. And we've taken a 11-point uh, advantage, man. We've scored the, la the, the last two. Colin will seem to be struggling on their defensive side. Or maybe Melbourne are just executing very well. Big bump. A Bailey Fritch again. Oh, no. It doesn't go to McDonald. But if he could get on the end of this bounce... Oh, he can't get the tackle away. And apparently, um, soccering or FIFA, as I like to say, doesn't work these days. But that's all right. Colin, we're going to play it short. Play it on. Into the square. Prusi, no mark. Nathan Jones with the clearance. A big bump by McDonald. Didn't end up working out to his advantage. And in fact, he's been very slow. And Colin would might get on the end of this. No one does. Tries to get a kick away. And here it comes. Viney needs to get something going here. Another punch. No. Nothing ending. Not, nothing working. And Collingwood with the hand passing play. Another mark. 
and I'm putting it straight away. Brown, no mark, Hannon, good tackle. Our boys are playing very well, but can anything happen to get us cleared? And we're just clearing it away. We do not want them to get it. Spargo, very good mark. And I think that's going to be a good mark again. No, it's not. Tackled by Fritch. You'd expect in a 2 one, one situation that we would get that mark, but it didn't end up working like that. Collingwood clears. Mark by Moore. Play short. And it ends up costing them very well. Pendlebury gets tackled. Oh, and we're getting, we're getting in the double team plays here. There we go. Siren has sounded. The wind is strong. I think this should get us a goal. It should. It should. And it's going to. Melbourne, very clinical. Very, very clinical. And we've scored three goals to their none in this quarter. And Melbourne have demonstrated their dominance in the second quarter. But we know in real life, and they're probably in the game, can Melbourne play all four quarters? That's the question to be asked. Collingwood needs to ask those questions now. Deliver a hell of a second half. But let's see if Melbourne can show any resemblance of that beautiful second quarter. Bruce gets tackled. And Collingwood again are going to play it short. Kicks it to a one-on-one -on -one contest. Oh, and he does well, May. Tackled by Jetta. Cleared away. No mark from any team here. Jones, good tackle. Bruce doesn't have the pace, but he kicks along into the 50. No mark from Petrarca. Cleared away again by Collingwood. Very back and forth stuff here. And it's a tackle by Taylor Adams. Brucey has actually won a lot of these rough contests. Very interesting stuff. But it's hair passed away and Collingwood again. Big, big. Oh, it just runs clear. It's a goal. I shepherded him. I'm pissed. But anyway. Oh, no. Brucey's off. Oh, man. We're not winning anymore. Cleared away. Oh, I kicked it backwards. It's a one-on-one -on -one contest. Yeah, oh, we don't get it. And Collingwood just like that. Split second. And they're going to get the goal, man. Oh, no. Oh, that sucks. Elliot. Of course, Elliot's going to score, man. All right, guys. We have to play strong here. We cannot let them get the next one. Otherwise, all of our hard work has been outdone in a matter of seconds, really. Harms takes a very good grab. Kicks it to a one-on-one -on -one contest here. There's a two-on-one -on -one now. And here we go, Langdon. We need to play on. Kick it into the square. Petrarca! There we go. Just like that, things go in our favor. And I think this should be perfect for a goal. And it is. And Melbourne get another goal back. That's brilliant play from Melbourne there. Well done. Again, we're not winning the ruck battles here. We don't have a backup ruckman. Max Gorn is still injured. And that's a good tackle. And here come Melbourne again. Try to hand pass away. Oh, that's a big bump. Oh, Neil Bullen. Come on, big mark here. Well done. Good lead. I'm taking it. I'm not even going to trust Petrarca. And this should take us again into a further goal. And it does. Bailey Fritch does well. He's had two goals so far, man. He's, I think he's the leading scorer. Melbourne are showing their dominance here. Oh, and here they go. Cleared it away. Harms. Big punch from Harms. Socket it off the ground. How's that a goal? Okay, uh, let's watch the replay. I assume it just went over the line, but it, I have to... Oh, it didn't even show. Okay, I really thought I got there, to be honest. But, oh well, Salem. Salem can't get the clearance. McDonald does. Marked by Neil Bullen. Oh, but Petrarca tries to go for the screamer. Oh, and the computer has screwed me once again. And if they score from this, I'm going to be pissed. The computer robbed me. But McDonald, he clears it away. Spargo. Big punch by Spargo. Petrarca. Big bump. Oh, but he can't kick straight. Collingwood. Good tackle. And it's cleared away. And that's going to be a mark. Yeah, well done on that diving grab. What can he do here? He decides to get the hand pass going. Good tackle. Grundy. Oh, there's three three or four players that are open at the moment. This is what I hate about this game. He's kicked it out. 
Oh man, he went too far out. All right, I'm gonna try and kick it to a one-on-one -on -one contest here. It's gonna end up being a two-on-two. -two. Oh, and they've marked a side bottom. Colin would have a bunch of stars on their team. Cleared away, Harms with the tackle. Jetta clears into the forward line. Brown needs the mark. Spargo ends up taking it. Okay, I'm gonna play on, kick it to the 50 and hope for a mark from one of our players. Oh, he's dived in there. Good tackle, good bump. Hand pass. Another hand pass by Fritsch. And we've got the goal. Fritsch has three goals. This guy has performed tremendously well. That looks nothing like him, but still. Melbourne get another goal, 43 to 26. A very exciting game. Another clearance by Langdon. Big hits. Third quarter is over. Melbourne winning by 17 points, the exact same score as the second quarter. So we've, we've established and maintained a lead. The fourth quarter is all where it matters now. We're either going to keep the lead or we're going to lose the lead. It's one or the other. Can verse versus second. Can Melbourne end up winning this important rivalry? And Collingwood win it by a mile. And their hand-passing play is going to get them into a goal. It's not. It will in the end, I think. Yes, it will. Just like that, man. All that took for Collingwood to get back was just two or three hand passes because we can't win a ruck battle. We're going to have to keep relying on our grit and determination and our clinicalness in the forward line. Neil Bullen tackled. And here they come again. We need a big bump. There we go. And they're going for a second. It's going to be a behind. They're getting closer and closer. Collingwood are unraveling Melbourne at the moment. Are you serious? Are you taking the piss at the moment? How, first of all, how did he get that? And there was a guy legit right there. Nathan Jones saves us from embarrassment, really. I'm going to try and clear it away into a one-on-one. -on -one. No mark from anybody. All right, hand pass. Spargo. In the end, doesn't work, but it's a big bump. And Melbourne have the numbers here. Oh, he ran away from it. Come on. Disgusting, man. A forward should not run away from the ball. Big bump. Tackled. High tackle by Malstrom. Nathan Jones going to take the mark. Prissy, punch. Out of bounds. 10-point game. Melbourne are struggling to hang on to everything that they've worked so hard for. Cleared by Petrarca. Bullen. And it's marked by Magden. It's played on. Here come the hand-passing plays. Bull Neville Jenner with the tackle. Harms. Big bump by Stephen May. Hand-passes right in there. And ladies and gentlemen, it is less than a one-goal game here. Collingwood are desperate and they're fighting with everything. They're just as hard working as Melbourne and they're showing it here. Big hits. We need a tackle. We don't get one. And that's going to be a mark. That is surely going to be a mark. And it is. And that's it. Honestly, I feel like we're going to lose now. The pressure's getting to me. I, I don't know what to do. I, I, I find it hard to believe he's going to miss this one. He's missed it. Okay. Three-point game, guys. Oh, no. All right. Come on, surely. No one else marks it but me. Thank you. All right, we're going to kick it to the crowd, just like Marvin does in real life. Big hits. Salem. Tom McDonald. Oh, Brown, I tried to bump. Why does the bump does not work at anybody, man? Big hit, please. There we go. Tackles. Come on, Nathan Jones. We need someone. Oh, they just run away with it. Pendlebury. Come on, Lever. No, Lever, you need to mark that. Harms clear, please. Oh, you're joking, man. The one thing you need to do is clear it and mark. Oh, fuck off, man. That's bull. That is bull. Clay and Oliver. Fritch, we need a mark, Fritch. No mark from anybody. And they're going to clear it away. Brayshaw is going to mark it. There's not much to go to in terms of forward line pressure here. Going to hope for the best. Oh, and he gets me. Hand pass. Oh, he shrugged the tackle. There's two minutes left. We need something here. Salem, clear, please. Oh, and he doesn't get it. Tackle. 
please. A big mark. All we need is a mark. We don't get it. Uh, I, I think it's over, guys. One minute left. High tackle. All right, this is now or never. Now or never. Yes! Now! It's now! All right. Don't screw this up. Do not screw this up. Final siren's gone. I think this should be enough. I think this should be enough. And it's enough! We win on the final goal! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What a game. It took the last possession. It's now or never and Melbourne showed up and it's now, it's now. We've won. Oh my goodness, celebrations all around. Melbourne deserved this. And funnily enough, I'm wearing black and white, but I don't give a shit, man. Melbourne deserved the win. Collingwood came back and they took the lead so late. But the last possession of the game, one of the most historic moments in AFL Evolution 2, man. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. And it's a rivalry game nonetheless. We win by three. You can't ask for a better game than that, can you, man? End-to-end -end stuff. Comebacks galore. I couldn't be more proud of this team anymore. Wow. Let's take a look at the ladder. That's going to be the first loss for Mar for Collingwood in a while. They won five straight. So let's see the ladder, man. Let's take a look at how things are going. Wow. We've got Carlton next, by the way. So all the Navy Blue fans, get ready. That's going to be a good one for the next episode. There we go. Let's take a look. So... Collingwood are still second. So I believe Carlton are in the eight. So there we go. That's going to be the eight at the moment. Gold Coast is in the eight. Very interesting. Richmond might not even make it. They're going to have to win their next game as they kill the need to lose. And they've got high percentage. So Richmond might not even make the eight. Very interesting stuff. But uh, overall, a very, very proud performance. I am extremely happy. I want to thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe if you're new. You have to subscribe. Look at that game. Look at that game and just just come on. Come on. That deserves it. At least a like. Anyway, um, have a wonderful and safe day. Take care and peace.